All right, what is going on, guys? Today we are watching Higahito episode three, I believe. Episode three, yeah, episode three. Um, I'm definitely looking forward to this uh, anime and seeing how this is going to go. Obviously, the last two episodes have been pretty interesting, actually, considering um, like kind of the plot line of the story. Um, but I've actually really enjoyed it, and I'm looking forward to the rest of them seeing how this goes. So, uh, as always, guys, like the video if you like the video, and subscribe to the channel if you are new. And let's go into the episode right now. Oh. Okay. Bro, she looks fucking dead. Bro. Looks like she, she did, like... The way it turned to day, it didn't even look like she actually got to sleep, like... God. What a fucking rough life, bro. <laughs> you look like a mess. <laughs> oh, better. Why would he? He's told you he has no interest in you in that way whatsoever. Bro, he, he has someone do his chores. What the fuck? That is what's in it for him. <laughs> that, those, that pair of underwear is way too small. What the fuck? No, he shouldn't. You've just dealt with fucking weirdos. <laughs> yeah, what other reasons? In the next two weeks? Bro. <laughs> Bro's ordering from the US or something. <laughs> At what? Uh, she doesn't know. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, the um, the package at home is making uh, cabbage miso soup tonight. <laughs> What's her deal, bro? What does she want? He's not gonna kick you out. He might not keep you forever, but he's like, he's not gonna kick you out, bro. Come on. Possibly true, yes. Oh, she's gonna go and see. Maybe. It's an interesting way of thinking that, realising fate is fate, like, much later on, after it's happened. Yeah. Was it meeting him? <laughs> Do your best. Oh. 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 That's quite the way to uh, reject someone, but he's pretty stern about these things, so I respect that. Oh, I don't think she was thinking that far ahead. I think she was just thinking, would anybody find her? Hopefully she's still here. Oh, no. Oh, no. Where's she gone? You've hugged him before, right? I mean, but she obviously sees it as something completely different, but... Oh. Oh, that's quite the chance encounter. Oh, she's nice. I wonder if she... Oh, her being there, if he finds her, then she's gonna find out. Yeah, don't tell her you've been run on the run for six months now. Yeah, then why did you run away? Hmm, quite interesting. I want to see what's, what's really happened in her past. Yoshida's does quite, like, sh straight faced i guess like all he wants her is like do chores that's it he will tell you exactly what he wants but he's also just a nice person anyway at least you tried there's still things you can gain hmm. oh the person she's talking about at home is yoshida not her actual home i get it okay oh shit <laughs> he is way too young to have a child this old. Yeah, she thinks he, they're family. Good. Okay, that's fine. Okay, well. <laughs> Alright. He's very straight to the point. But apparently so is she. Yeah, but you're also a child. Okay, well, he did say to you, don't do this kind of stuff. Oh. I feel, for, I feel for her hard, man. She has dealt with some awful people. Come on, bro. 
Yeah, I'm glad he's able to restrain himself like this. I mean, she has a point, but sex isn't the answer, like. That's worse if they found that out, though. Like, if the police find that out and he also had this kind of thing with you, that's even worse, like. He just adores. Okay, fair enough, yeah. Good. A very stern no. Maybe she'll understand this now and maybe she'll start to realise she's more than just an object. Oh, sorry, not more than just an object. She's not an object, that's what I meant, sorry. Maybe he just needs a friend and you can be that for him. Be his friend, come on. I mean, he's got friends, but like, be a friend at home. <laughs> oh. Yeah. <laughs> he's such a good dude, man. Having no libido. <laughs> I hope this is really where she starts to change and realise more about herself, I suppose. She can just be this warm smile that awaits for him when he gets home. That's all she needs to be. Alright, so that was Higehiro episode 3. We have got we went into some kind of touchy topics right there in that episode. Um, some touchy scenes as well. Uh, it was nice to see kind of the girl from uh, Yoshida's work and like her take on things. And obviously now she knows about Sayu, but uh, only believes that she's just a member of his family. Um, hopefully now going forward that he's kind of given her the stern no and the obviously straight to the face. I want you here just because it makes me happy that you're here and not in any other way. So hopefully this is where she starts to kind of change and you know, just be a normal teenage girl, you know? And it's like, I think that's the whole point of it. And it's, um, you know, I'm liking the idea of this so far. Um, But yeah, uh, as always, guys, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode because I certainly did. And I hope you guys enjoyed my reaction. Thank you guys so much for watching. Have a nice rest of your day and peace out.